Well, it's one of the surprise stories in the Valley of the Sun in 2017. The Arizona State Sun Devils picked to finish six in the preseason Pac-12 poll, ranked number three in the country, and tonight putting their undefeated record on the line against Longwood University of Virginia. All right, here was the scene tonight at Wells Fargo Arena. A bit of a late-arriving crowd on a Tuesday against a small school, but the 942 crew came ready to party for their undefeated Sun Devils, ranked third in the country, and this got the crowd going. Mickey Mitchell, the dunk to make it 14-10. He had 12 off the bench. I think a star might have been bored. He went to the crowd a couple times making defensive plays and brought energy. Trey Holder cans a three. He had 20. Sun Devils only up four, but Remy Martin, man, he was throwing some passes tonight like you want to believe. Zips one into Cody Justice right here to make it 25-18. Justice had 18, four threes, and then right before the half, Daquan Lake, the dunk. He had 16 points off the bench, but still pretty tight game. Only 35-30, but ASU would find its flow in the second half. As we talked about, Mickey Mitchell, maybe a star has been born. The transfer from Ohio State, originally from Plano, Texas, the dunk on the breakaway. That ignited a 40-17 run. And then watch this, the play of the game, maybe the play of the season. You're going to see this quite a bit. Remy Martin somehow goes between his legs in the air, doesn't get called for traveling, doesn't get called for palming the ball. I'm not sure how he did it. Bobby Hurley wasn't even sure how he did it, but everybody in the arena was impressed, even Grant Hill, the former Phoenix Sun, Bobby Hurley's former college teammate. The Sun Devils stay undefeated, beating Longwood, an impressive play by Martin, and it looked like an impressive win on the scoreboard. Was Bobby Hurley impressed? Very pleased with the win and the response and, you know, how we played the entire second half. I think we're fortunate that we played that first half you know, taking nothing away from Longwood, but this opponent, if we had done it in some other games, uh, you know, there might have been a different result. So we got to clean that up. All right, so the Sun Devils stay undefeated. Next up, a matchup with the University of Pacific on Friday, and then the big one down in Tucson, December 30th in primetime, post-Fiesta Bowl, with the Sun Devils visiting their rival, the University of Arizona. I'm Mark McClune for Arizona's Family.